Hey, you, <laughs> go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button for me, player. You did. So, yeah, why are we back? And we're going to talk about the types of mental health. There are four that I found. There might be more. Some people are looking wrong, but I think if you want to name names, a lot of those names probably fall under the four categories that we're about to talk about. Um, dogs that work, dogs that help people. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, leave a comment. Um, this is what we're in the game for. Breeding, emotional support animals, emotional support bulls, service bulls, big spring bull. You know. The four types of mental health are mood disorders. What are mood disorders? Depression and bipolar disorders. Oh man, oh man, look, I'm telling you. Um I deal with it all the time, every day. Uh I have a family that has depression. Uh, I think I'm only bipolar with my money low. I'm about, I'm hungry. But house play um I, I deal with i deal with anger issues i know my wife deals with major depression i mean like i i never really dealt with depression until i met her and i got i, I really gained the understanding of uh the needs for a person with depression and anxiety, anxiety. Uh, some of us work to keep our mind off a lot of things some of us Wallow in the pity, I guess you could say. Uh, some people get depressed, they get anxiety, they can't get up out of the bed. And these, that's, these, those falls up under the category of mood disorders. Uh, person loses their job or, or routine in life has been cut off. That can that can really damage somebody. Um, crazy. Uh, I've, I've, I've worked in restaurants for years and I've dealt with a lot of people with a lot of emotional disorders. And, and, and restaurants are very high stress environments. If anybody don't know that. Um, the next one, anxiety disorder, which I was kind of diagnosed with anxiety about two or three years ago. I was diagnosed with ADHD when I was a child, for sure. Um, I was on Ritalin, I'm a Ritalin baby. You know, uh, I blame Ritalin on a lot of things that I encountered as I grew up, you know, influences, you feel me? Uh, I am a recovering addict, for those that may or may not know, if you can, I cannot tell. Uh, you know, uh, but my dogs are my anti-drug, you know. Uh, that's that's, part, that's that's a future campaign we're going to run to. Um, personality disorders, um, psychiatric disorders, uh, schizophrenia, a disorder that can affect a person's ability to think, feel, and behave clearly. Um, let's go back over those. The four types of uh, mental health. There are mood disorders, depression or bipolar disorder, <laughs> anxiety disorder, excuse me, personality disorders, psychiatric disorders, which includes schizophrenia. This is a disorder that affects a person's ability to think, feel, and behave clearly. So that almost goes back to the definition where it says, uh, it, it's, it determines how we handle stress, relate to others and make healthy choices. Um, if, if your mental is not right, you can't, you can't, uh, can't make good decisions. So even after losing a loved one, they tell you not to make any major decisions after a year or two. And I mean, a lot of people don't know that, you know, I didn't know that for a while, but I understand why, you know, because in, in that grieving process, you're going to search for a whole lot of things to try to uh, numb that pain, and that's not always possible. Uh, I, I didn't realize how deep in my depression I was when I had my first episode uh, after my daddy died. I didn't have any time off. I was I was a general manager at the restaurant, um, and, and it, it was bananas. Like the only time that I had off was the time that I was in the hospital with him, and, and that took a toll. Watching him die within that week 
took a toll on my mental, my moves, like everything, you know, lack of sleep. Like sleep is important, eating right, all that plays a part in 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 into the way to 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 to, to control your mental health. Like not necessarily control your mental health, but build your mental health a little stronger if you were capable of doing that. You know, um, because a, a lot of a lot of our mental health problems just lie in the, in the diet. But that's not always the case. Um, but changing a diet can change the mood. So just altering the mood sometimes. You know, that's just the, the light forms of mental health. Um, problems, anxiety. Um, anxiety, A, panic attacks. Bipolar disorder, by body dysmorphic. And that was a different one. Uh, borderline personality disorders. Depression, disassociation, Dissociation and disassociation disorders and eating problems. Huh. It just gets deeper. So, mental health affects everything from the way we walk, talk, think, eat. A lot of things in your day-to-day -day life, if, if not if left unchecked, can can be unhealthy. Um, and even in that process, you realize that even what, what you're going through is affecting somebody else. So you can't be ignorant about that either. So please take your loved ones' advice if they if they see and they feel like something's wrong. You know, just listen. All right. This is your boy Joe Blaze. And it's another one on this anxiety talk. And we gonna holler back at you. Hey, back at you. Just want to let you know, man. I'm not a doctor. I'm a, a uh, I'm a, I'm a breeder, up and coming, learning, uh, and I'm a nine to five hard worker. Um, I do a lot of research, so uh, always get a doctor's. You know, everything requires diagnosis. Now I'm just giving you insight on things to look for, uh, to to either uh, kind of self-diagnose to get yourself in a position to actually see somebody that can tell you what's really going on, or you know just identify the symptoms. But all symptoms require diagnosis and characterized by through uh, thoughts or experience that seems out of touch. So. Uh, Causes of mental health is unknown. Sometimes it's a combination of genetics. The environment and altered brain chemistry and structure may play a role. And I kind of said that in the uh, little spin earlier. But uh, that was a little quick one for you, man. Your boy, Joe Blaze.